Snoop. Can I get you for the socials real quick? Yes, sir. Steve Grinnell with Snoop Dogg, the one and only man, uh, Charlie Murph, Charlie Wilson, I'm sorry, Charlie, Charlie Wilson, man, uh, celebrating his star, celebrating, you know, his birthday. Just what are some of your early memories of listening to Charlie Wilson and what, 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 what memories does that bring back? I can't believe he's my uncle, he's my friend. Um, childhood memories of his music waking me up in the morning, mama playing the music on the A-track cassette, going to football practice, hearing his music. Just all of this shit, the video party train with them with the bikinis on in the, in the boxing ring with the cowboy hats, you know what I'm saying? All that inspiring shit that he did and then to finally be able to, to meet him at his lowest point and then to be able to give him life and then for him to be able to save my relationship and to be a part of my life, that's God. I mean, it's a beautiful thing. To, to know that he's been a part of like damn near every step of my career and what he just told me was that I've been a part of his career so it's a beautiful love that we have that is unmatched you know what I'm saying it's like God gives you a family but then you create your family and he's one of the family members that I created that's beautiful man man uh, at his start today I thought maybe you were going to give him advice I thought he was going to thank himself you know thank himself for getting there and, and all that you didn't you didn't give him any advice on the on the speech he's so gracious <laughs> because you got to understand how long he's been in this industry so for you to be at the top and then go all the way to the bottom and then have to reinvent yourself again takes a lot and it wouldn't have worked without the spirit not without his beautiful wife like I said she was instrumental when I first got around him she was very, you know, strong about you ain't having none of this shit around him. That's why I'm out here smoking. It's my shit, but I'm outside. Still got to respect her to this motherfucking day. Is there anyone else that gets that from Snoop Dogg? All, all women get that. My mother raised me, so they all get that respect. She just, like, the, she's the version of my mother, so I got to be like... Got to got to air out a little gotta, bit. Yeah, <laughs> Take the walk with the cousins. I when I smoke, but it's... It's all for the benefit of the better. Sometimes you need this, but you need to have respect. You're never too big to be checked. You gotta always stay in your place. Your child's supposed to stay in his place. Someone's older than you, by that many years, you're a child to them. Definitely. Snoop, wisdom, appreciate it. Thank you so much for your time, always. Thank you. Man, I Snoop, just who, who's... Snoop. Wow. He may be old. <laughs> you think Canelo's too prime. old for Benavides? You gotta catch people like that on their prime. But what you don't want to do is get in the ring with him, though, because he turns into a monster when he gets in the ring. So you don't want to poke the bear. Is is Canelo, you think, a little too long in the tooth for Benavidez, you think? Canelo the shit. I don't go against him at all. All my Mexican friends love calling me when he's fighting a black fighter trying to bet me. <laughs> it, it's not racist, it's the truth. Right. All you motherfuckers, y'all love calling me when Canelo fighting against a black man. You want to bet, Holmes? <laughs> Holmes, you want to bet? <laughs> Fuck it, let's bet. <laughs> but if it's Mexican on Mexican, who y'all going to take? Now? <laughs> They're talking about he might fight a younger Charlo, I mean, a big Charlo next, and then Terrence Crawford for his next two fights. Crawford the one. Now that's budded. Got Bud Crawford? That's where I got my money at. I'm betting on Bud. For, you, you got Bud? Motherfucking Bud. Bud. <laughs> Nebraska, Nebraska, you hear me? Go with the underdog. Speaking of the underdog, it's on Amazon Prime right now. Go check it out. Right uno, numero uno. <laughs> there it is. Appreciate you, Snoop. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. I heard his voice. I said, "Where are you going? Where are you going in the cheap seats, man? Where the pictures in forty years ago, man? Show me some of the pictures, man. You got them, man. Charlie, you got your computer? Yeah. Okay. Last ride. Give it to Mike. Thank you, Pepsi. Is it? Yes, it's there. Yes, sir. Snoop, give it to Pepsi. You tell me you know how to run a computer. Pepsi, dude.
more just like that and one more like that. Thank you, folks. Stick around with me. I remember this. You were with us. Bring them people. Let him in. Let him in. He's out. He's with the band. Bring them in. Let him 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 in.